Good morning, everyone. <laughs> Today we are sailing, or a little bit of sailing. We have Kim, Sarah, and the kids on board with us again. And I would say that the solar project is officially completed. Well, as completed as I think we can get it this time around. But Kim and Sarah have two more days here in Mallorca. And so, since we don't really have much to work on on the solar project, on a solar project anymore. We're just gonna sail around the corner and enjoy those two days out on anchor. And we also have our friends Jordan and Des. They are right next to us. So they're going to sail along with us and we're all going to enjoy a beautiful little tiny speck of yeah. paradise. I'm excited. Me too. Yeah, they uh, they stopped in for a few days to wait out a bit of weather. Um, so we're just gonna we're just gonna hang out. We're gonna have a good time. Yeah yeah. And it's I don't know, we don't have wind instruments still, so it's blowing maybe 10 gusting to 15, so we're probably just gonna drift downwind with the head sail out. Mm -hmm. Nice, slow, chill sail. But yeah, we're ready to rock and roll. Yeah. And it's only five miles that way, so it shouldn't take us long. Then, yeah, if you guys are just gonna drift with the head sail, then we may, there's a chance, yeah. Yeah. Well, anyway, cool, sounds good, we'll see you there then. Absolutely, we'll see you there. By the way, check this out. Look at all this like Sahara desert sand. That's just you probably won't all be able to over, see it on camera. Probably every time not, it rains. but it's all over our boat every time it rains. Crazy. Well, you won't see it on my finger because I'm the same color. How are you guys liking this sail? Oh, it's awesome. Fantastic. It's always good to sail. Like, get out, mm. relaxing. Just the sound of the sea and the wind. That's good. That's the best. It's the best. It's better than an RV. Oh, yeah, definitely. Definitely better <laughs> than an <laughs> RV. You have to admit that. <laughs> yeah. So, what are so, we doing? Baby woke up, so the main sail came up too. Uh, yeah, the wind's pretty light, but we're having a nice little sail. Three knots, upwind-ish. And uh, we just cleared the lighthouse. And Atticus is behind us. And we got four more miles to go till we can anchor. Not a long commute. No, I like it. Well, we just got as close as we could to Atticus so that Jordan can fly the drone and get some really awesome shots of like the two of our boats sailing beside each other. A little reunion since Mexico. Um, but the cala we're going to is right on our beam, so we're about to tack and head in and drop anchor. It's not gonna die down. This swell is gonna stick around. Okay, so we just dropped our sails and we're now entering that little cala, but Atticus is already um, kind of circling around in there and checking it out as well. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of rolling and it's kind of tight. I mean, we can anchor a little bit further out, but no problem. We don't have to be tucked all the way in here. There's not any more swell out there than there is in here. Because this swell sort of coming from the east. Yeah. So yeah, it would be it would be just as exposed to this swell. <sighs> it's deep enough and wide enough. If we just center up in the middle and anchor, I think we'll be all right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you want to just like anchor for a little while and just see what happens? Just see how crappy it is. If it's crappy, we'll leave. If it's not crappy, we'll stay. Yeah, okay. All right. Yeah, we can do that. Do we have everything we need out of the freezer? We don't need anything out of the freezer. So. Sarah and Kika went grocery shopping today. So they know what's for dinner? Yes. So 
where they're cooking at. Yes. Which means I just get to hang out with this cute little kid. Right? You're gonna hang out? Yeah. I'm just gonna feed you. Like a puppy. <laughs> she doesn't get it. She's like, I'm confused what's going on right now. <laughs> I like how everybody is just like watching. <laughs> <laughs> now this is a special moment because I don't yeah. usually cook, but we found a really cool recipe at the grocery store today. And since we went grocery shopping, we should be the one making that special recipe. I like how we're eating on our boat with like eight people instead of eating on their boat where they can actually see <laughs> they have eight the space. people. <laughs> Yeah, I know. But playground is perfect. Yeah, that's for true. Kids, so. Because we have this. Yeah. Yeah. So we win. So we cook the sauce. We, the sauce first. we keep it apart on the side and then we boil the pasta. So that when the pasta is ready, we can you just, just pour and we can warm it will warm up with the pasta. Yeah, that's a good idea because we have a tiny stove. We don't have space for yeah. boiling water and cooking the sauce. Once the sauce is good, we're gonna put it to the side. Make the and pasta, and then when the pasta is good, we're just gonna add the sauce, together. and then yeah, done. Sounds like a good plan. Ooh, yes, look at that. In the meanwhile, she has to pee. <laughs> she can use the toilet if she wants. Uh, yeah, oh, sure. that's true. Oh, yeah. yeah, we have a toilet. But she likes being out. I'm gonna awkwardly film you from way up here. Okay. Yeah. Put yeah. on here, yeah. and then we're gonna transfer. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna add. Tonight on the Kika cooking show. Okay, we did it. Well, pasta is cooking for tradition. Mm -hmm. Add two tablespoons of butter. 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 It says two cups, but we're just gonna we're just gonna glue 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 we're just I gonna mean, put the whole yeah, bag. Exactly. Let's face it. Oh yeah. We bought two bags for it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Cheese is good. Oh, We're not yeah. gonna put one third of a cup. And maybe it's making it. It's yeah, it's gonna. Drying. It's gonna yeah. make it fluffy. Yeah. As the last one. Yeah. Yeah. So, we yeah. Yeah. so earlier we were joking that we didn't know why we decided to have dinner on our boat because we don't have a single table anywhere and we have two, four, six adults, six adults and two kids, kids <laughs> eating dinner tonight. And we're like, we should just have dinner on Atticus because like they have a table. <laughs> but we didn't actually mention it and they just texted saying like, you guys just want to bring the food over here? We should just eat on our boat because we have a table. <laughs> so we're going to pack up this dinner once it's done and head over to their boat yeah. and uh, enjoy dinner on their boat instead. <laughs> but is it going to be enough for six people? Definitely. I'm more worried about the pot, pot? Than about falling over. <laughs> oh, shit. Everything tipped over. And luckily, it tipped over on the hall side, not on my side, so I didn't get burned. No, yeah, you can take like, over now. But the luckily we didn't we didn't lose too much of the sauce and we didn't lose any of the pasta so we can still continue cooking. Yeah. Yeah. I supplemented the sauce with milk and flour to like get it back cuz a third of it is kind of behind the stove now. But yeah, the the little holders weren't up so the pot slid and then it throws the weight off and everything just started sliding off the back. But we didn't lose any pasta, just mostly water. All right, there's, ha there's sort of handles where I'm, I'm passing it to you. Yeah. There's towel underneath, but yeah. careful, it's like pretty cool. Bye, Uma. We're not abandoning you, we'll be back. We're like Uber Eats. <laughs> What's up, gang? All right, pasta yeah. baby. We're I being boarded pasta by baby. pasta pirates. Oh yeah. All right. Nice. It's probably the biggest pasta meal we've ever made. Yeah? <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah. uh, there should be a... <laughs> and children are cutting. Yeah, watch space. Yeah. Yeah. Jordan can even stand up. Look at that. Yeah, I know, right? That's super In the galley. So it just like heaves okay. them onto your boat. Yeah, Osa was very excited at first. <laughs> and so it was a, a, a little much. But now he's calming down. 
Yeah. It's going to be a, a good way to like baby proof your boat, like test it out. Yeah, we were just talking. Before you buy, you know? Yeah, you try it before you buy. Yeah, right. <laughs> it is so. We were just talking about that. We've never had children or babies on the boat, which is kind of crazy if you think about it, right? Oh, is that it? Yeah, yeah. Just, you want this? Yeah. Oh, we could do it. Oh my um, god, this smells so oh, good. There you go. Ooh. You want a bread? Guys, like, yeah. oh, cheers. Yeah. Like, cheers, guys. Cheers. Yeah. Like around, yeah. around the table. Around the around the uh, cheers to Atticus. <laughs> ah. Look at that, guys. You're like already <laughs> in the bed. Right? Uh, uh, Aurora, where are you sleeping? Where's your bed? So she's going to sleep with Gusty. And the shark. Hello. And her parents' bedroom is right next to her. <laughs> Super <With> my... comfortable. <laughs> Super comfortable. It's like sleeping in the same room. It is sleeping in the same room. What? Well, yeah. We're all sleeping in the same room. Yeah. Because like our bed is literally right there. <laughs> you wanna say goodnight to everyone? You wanna say goodnight? Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Hello. Cheers. <laughs> just made it back from the hike with Jordan and Dez and now it's like kind of gross and rainy and kind of blowing they just took off and they're heading back to Palenza because tomorrow there's supposed to be a really strong front a mistral's coming down and it's going to be Potentially like 30 or 40 knots of wind. Sometimes it's only like 20. Um, but we're about to move as well. The kids just woke up and so we're making a little bit of like late lunch and waiting for whatever the rest of this rainy nonsense is. And then we're gonna head back to Plants as well and hunker in and hide from this next front that's coming tomorrow morning. We've got Chef Kim scrambling up some eggs. Yeah, we're like light wind drifting. <laughs> like two knots. We are. We're slowly making our way back to Polenza. Uh, that little weather front that we were waiting on has passed. It didn't bring that much wind, which is good. But these guys are going to hop on their RV and head back to Italy. So they need to go to Palma today. So we're, yeah, we're going back slowly. When is light and variable? <laughs> well, the wind is pretty much dead, uh, but we're only a mile away and everybody's asleep. So just rolled up the sails and turned the motor on just enough that we're still doing two knots um, to kind of slow down how long it's going to take us to get there. Because I know as soon as you drop the anchor, some of them are going to wake up. And uh, right now it's just a nice chill sort of nap time, which is pretty sweet. <laughs> My is that? What's happening? It's it's haircut. It's haircut. Is it time. finally time? It is time. This is going away. Who's cutting it? Aurora, of, of course. She's the best one. Are you cutting it? Okay. Is this for you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Should I sit here? Yeah, and a horse is stand behind and you. Okay. And and Sarah. So how, how does it work? It like it just, oh, it just cut. cuts wherever you yeah. put it to. Okay. okay. <laughs> I mean, a normal person would probably start with scissors, but this is more entertaining for sure. Are you ready for the front? Your hair is so thin that it's not even like yeah, it's not even. It's like, I don't know. It was like, it just would not cut my hair. Done? Whoa. Fun. I think she should be. I think you here. should leave it just like that. Show me what you got. Yeah. <laughs> like yeah, a half we, shave? We I think it looks, I think it looks good. Are you going to leave it like this? I hope not. <laughs> like, the, the rest is perfect. Like, it's liberating and stuff like that. The one thing that irritated me for like the last month is still here. So it's like, yeah, I'm not going to leave it like this. <laughs>
<laughs> it probably looks quite funny though. I cannot see myself, so I don't know. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not fancy. If it's not something that's not, it's not fancy. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely yeah. <laughs> Come on. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. Can get used to that. Look at this. So short. <laughs> Happy? I have to get used to that. No, I like it. You're gonna scream in the morning yeah. like that. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? Do you like, Do you like it, Aurora? We're eating, so. <laughs> we don't eat? care. Guns How does he look? Like? Who's that? Who's that? Is that Papa? Is it still Papa? All right, cool. Okay, yeah. <laughs> no, I didn't. I didn't lose my status. All right. Hello. Look at this dead animal on the floor. <laughs> it looks a lot darker on the floor than it. Yeah. I thought you were blonde. Yeah, I thought Me so too. too. <laughs> Wait, what <am> I mean? <laughs> <laughs> it But it's not over yet. The last phase is you have to jump in the water. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> How does it feel to swim without hair, without oh, that drag? Oh, it's awesome. I can see stuff. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. It feels liberating. Yeah, it feels totally like Look at that. I feel lighter. Blood, no, it's awesome. Oh. Okay, we don't have to carry. Say ciao. Ciao! Bye, yeah. she's coming, she's coming. Oh, she's holding my uh, Bye, Kika! Bye, Kika! Bye, Kika! Bye, thunder and lightning kind of all around us. I have no idea if it's going to bring too much wind, but we've got <laughs> seven or eight to one anchor chain out and I just put the, <laughs> I just put the long snubbers on. So if there's wind in there, um, we'll be fine. And if not, it might just be a lot of rain for a little while and then it's really hard to tell with these, with these mistrals blowing off of France, the wind because last time it came through, we saw 40 knots and Corsica saw 115 knots. And I think you can hear the rain coming. You can hear the rain coming, so it's about to dump. Um, yeah, so it's four o'clock in the morning and we're just gonna see what's happening. <laughs> It's a short one this time. Well, I'm glad we're going to be in the med together for a little while. I know. It's yeah, you good. guys really need to plan on some time in Malta. Yeah. That way we can really hang out. And you get to hang out with the baby. Have fun sailing to Malta. All right, yeah, we'll see you in Malta. I we definitely so. see you in Malta. I hope Dude, so. No hope so, man. We will. Or somewhere nearby. Bye. Yeah. Bye. Bye. You can drive faster now. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> I can, I can, can I hear them? Jordan's voice travels pretty far than that. <laughs> I can hear him talk to the camera. <laughs> <laughs> we had a really good time hanging out. It, it was fun because it's like a five year reunion and we didn't have time to do a Maticus challenge. I know you guys were really excited to see that, but we'll definitely catch up with them again. So we're back to being alone and lonely. <laughs> lonely? I'm here. I'm here, Come back, Kai!
I'm here. I'm right here. Yeah, but we're 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 lonely together. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, it's interesting Whoa. because like for almost a month, almost three months, we haven't been by ourselves because we had Maya over, then we had our friends uh, Sarah and Kim, and then and then we hung out with Des and Jordan. So it's going to feel a little bit weird to be by ourselves again. I think, <laughs> even though it's only nesters. been three months, <laughs> but yeah, now it's time to get to work and catch up on the things that we haven't done in three months so that sounded dirty <laughs> <laughs> what she means is editing and boat projects <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay so should i do this again <laughs>